In this video, we'll use WMS to import data from the internet, delineate a watershed, and export it to Google Earth. To start, we'll launch the hydrologic wizard in WMS. This will help step us through the process of delineating a watershed and running a simple hydrologic model. First, we'll save the project, and then set up the project bounds for the watershed. We'll then use WMS to download DM data and a topographic map from the Internet. Next, we'll resume the hydrologic wizard and use Topaz to compute flow accumulations. We can view the DM to see the flow accumulations computed by Topaz. We'll then place an outlet at the bottom of the watershed we would like to delineate and use WMS to delineate the watershed from the outlet. Next, we'll resume the hydrologic wizard and select the hydrologic model. WMS supports several hydrologic models that can assist in computing hydrographs. We'll use NSS. We'll use the wizard to help clean up the model. Finally, we'll set up the NSS model for the watershed and use WMS to calculate some of the parameters. To view the output hydrograph, we'll double-click on the hydrograph icon. We'll then modify some of the display options to prepare the watershed to be exported to Google Earth. Next, we'll save the project as a Google Earth KMZ file. To view the watershed in Google Earth, we'll double-click the KMZ file that was just created. Visualizing the watershed in Google Earth can be a useful tool for helping engineers, managers and the public visualize a watershed model.